Happy New Year, everyone. My name is Dan. On YouTube, I am a first-person looter, and I am playing SnowRunner. This is video number 62 in the series, and I'm doing the job entitled More Parts. As I always do, I'm going to check the audio. As I always do, I'm going to check... And I hear the audio. In the meantime, we'll get the rest of the oil Derek squared away. Take these boxes to the factory and we'll see you, we'll see to it that you're rewarded. An off-road truck is recommended. I got my Royal right here. It requires four, so my truck and my, um, and my scout, sh my, um, which I'm call it should be sufficient. I am running low on gas though. The new year hasn't stopped me from screwing up in the very beginning. There was a mission right above this that requires me to go to the valley, but I try to keep all my jobs to one location before I move to another location. I keep thinking these big tanky things here are oil tanks. I can refill some gas with this scout that I have. But there's also gas stations nearby. We'll see. Drilling spare parts, yes. One, two, three, four. Oh, are my own tires all messed up, huh? Not anymore. I think we need to map this out, but... No.
with what I'm carrying. I'm not going to take this little side thing here. I could go through the trees, but I'm not going to risk it. I'm just taking the safe way. It'll give me some time to warm up. Warm up my truck, warm up my ability to drive. Lighting effects glistening off of the ice is really nice. Like, what would that look like with ray tracing? I think it looks pretty damn accurate to me without the ray tracing. I don't know. I don't know. I think it looks pretty darn good. it out as if the game thinks I'm stuck and I need to focus and concentrate. But here comes oh, the music starting up again now that I got free. Little plucky guitar. And the Soundgarden guitar too. The Black Hole Sun guitar. Thanks for your neatness with all these cargos. Let's go up to the next one. Well, what does that mean? Next one. <clears throat> so drilling equipment takes me to White Valley, so I'm going to skip that for now. Morris has one. Take that to the sawmill. Whoa. <clears throat> All right, let's do this one. Lumber mill supplies. I am Mr. Blade, lowercase m, thank you very much. I don't normally work with outsiders, but I don't have much choice at this point. Our lumber mills are in desperate need of supplies. If you can help me, eh, I'll pay a fair price. So we'll go here first. Come here first because we can get gas and refuel. 
fuel oh fuel there too how oh, because that's another gas station service spare parts okay all I can get there is medium pipes Consumables and service spare parts. So service spare parts is yeah. Small pipes. Alright, so it does look like we'll get fuel there. We'll get metal beams there. We'll get small pipes right here. Oh, I need four service spare parts. Okay, so we're gonna have to do two, two trips. Oh, lovely, it's dark. Oh, lovely, it's beautiful snow, but scary dark and scary wind sounds. These wind scounders, wind sounds are scary. Let's put you in here. Yeah. What? How are we tipping this over already? I can just see some zombie wolves coming out coming out at me. I'll tell you what. So we have enough room for two two fuel. So I guess that's what I'll do. Two fuel. I'm two fuel for school. Thanks, Chase Cam. Do this. I don't want to go too far in here, so I don't have to back out too much. There we go. Steel River. Boy, that that, that text is very low quality. Okay, so fuel times two. One, two. Okay. Yeah, that gas is, look at, look at, it's like Nintendo quality. By Nintendo quality, I mean like, uh... Like Super Nintendo. So we'll have to skip some places and come back because we just don't have enough space. It'd be cool if you could attach another trailer to a trailer. Have a train of trailers. That way I don't have to just have one long solid trailer that holds five things. Are there even anything that holds six? I don't think there is.
but it's like chain as many trailers as you want together and see if you can do that. I guess there's a, maybe there's a mod that does that. Are there trailer mods? That'd be cool. I followed along to the instructions given to me to um, subscribe to different mods. And then I hit X to install it, but when I went to the garage, I don't see them listed in the truck store anywhere, even when I click on all trucks. I don't know if there's a special mod window to get those modded trucks. I didn't see any of them. Maybe I just had bad eyesight. Or my PlayStation is still glitching out when I never got the invites to the online well, co-op game. I don't know what happened. It said they downloaded. And then I click X, clicked X to install. That was the first one, so I'll, want, I'll do that one first because that was the first one. Okay, so now I need beams and service spare parts. So the only place to get service spare parts is way over here? Mm. Okay. So what is the service site? Service part, but not service spare parts, I guess. Drilling parts. Okay. I'll get metal beams on the way back. No point in bringing them... Bringing them up this way. And it's times four, so I don't think I'm even going to have space. So I'll, dr I'll drop my trailer off. At the metal beams. Oh no, I won't, no, because I, I need all four. Right, duh, that's what, we, that's what we just established. I need all four slots. I need to bring my trailer with me, of course. Being on this road, I probably could have gotten like a big giant trailer, but that would have only given me five. I still would have had to make multiple trips.
Thanks, Chase Cam. How about you go back down? No, excuse me. I don't want you closer. Oh my god. What the heck? Oh, I'll get fixed up. <laughs> Service bear parts. One, two. Try to get it in view here. Three, four. I wonder if you could put um, a difficulty setting on this game where the more difficulty settings give you like tires don't grip as well on ice, uh, trucks don't aren't as powerful. Um, maybe there's like more rocks in the ground, something like that. Maybe what the jobs require are doubled or tripled even. Like right now, instead of needing metal beams times one, the higher difficulty would say metal beams times two. So let's move this trailer out of the way here. I will detach the trailer and go get the metal beams. I'm always looking at the truck from this side. I don't I don't really know why that is. I there there's no like specific reason. It's just I feel like it's what I'm naturally comfortable looking at. And I only need to look at one side generally because if I know that my right tires are at a certain distance from the right side of the road, then that automatically means the left tires are going to be at their point in the road. I don't need to look at them also. I know that if my tires are right here, just about a tire's width away from the edge of the road, then my left tires are going to be plenty fine. If my right tires start to get into the middle of the road, then I'll know my left tires are now probably hugging the left side of the road. Almost. <clears throat> Wait, did I just totally... I just totally passed where I needed to go. <laughs> The Lumber Mill Supplies logo looks like either the Paramount Pictures logo or is it North Face or is it Columbia? I don't remember. beams. Oh, 
I should have looked. I was trying to do an interesting camera movement. And... Turns out that was a bad decision. Thank you. We appreciate your work getting those supplies to the mills. You're welcome. Well, Morris Mining's all done. Still gotta go to, uh, wherever you might call it, White Valley. On top of the world. What's this all about? To the truck stop. Okay, we're close to the truck stop. Consumables fuel, which we will get there since it's so close, and wooden planks right here, how about that? But consumables, we only get there, so I'm going to get, I'm going to do this, I'm going to go get consumables, I'm going to get fuel from here, and then I'm going to go get, uh, The wooden planks from here. That's two, four, eight. Oh boy. Once again, we ain't gonna have enough. Fuel times four. That's already gonna fill up everything. Well, shucks. In that case, hold on now. No. Yeah, if I have to carry eight things, I don't have enough. I guess I guess I could get like a really long truck, and then also a trailer that would hold more than enough, right? Heck yeah, I guess that would. Oh, hold on, we gotta activate it. Hey, we. How is it still nighttime? Shouldn't have. Too far away. I guess I have to, like, make sure that these dots are lined up, I guess. I don't know, is that close enough? Alright. I mean, I know the wood, I can drop off the wood pretty close. But either way, I have to get, con I have to get service spare part consumables, I mean, from here. I don't see, wait, wait, consumables. Does anywhere else have consumables? I don't think so. Let 
Nope. So I'd love to take the short way to get there, but I have to go out this way anyway. I wonder if people like look at multiple jobs and say, okay, when I go back to get these last things for the current job, I only need two spaces and I'm going to have my trailer. So what can I fill my trailer up with? Well, let me see what the next job is going to off is going to need. I bet people do that. That's probably a good idea. I don't think that far. I bet that's a good speed running technique though. Figure out multiple jobs like chess. Finally, the sun's coming out. I'll probably zip into the gas station. Always like to have my fuel tipped off. I mean, as long as I'm passing by, anyway. I'm, I wouldn't do it if I'm super far away from it. Symbols times two. And then the fuel will be from the gas station that's pretty darn close to where we're dropping everything off. So I don't have to go so far to go back for fuel. Ooh, look at this beautiful mountain. Very nice. Scary if you fell off of it. Don't want to go too fast around that corner. Curve. This is the smallest motel I've ever seen. It's only four rooms. A 
Where do you even, like... Like, where do you even, like, get keys and talk to customer service? Is one of these rooms the... the room where you check in? So there's actually only three rooms here? Oh, wait, no, I might be able to make this. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, shit, no, I need it, because I need fuel times four. Right, 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 right. No, it's not. I, why does this little tiny building need four pallets? Oh, there, there was a plosive. Four pallets of oil. Fuel. We didn't even read this thing yet. On top of the mountain is a little truck stop with a big heart. It's so popular with truckers that they just ran completely out of supplies. If you don't get some provisions up there soon, there may be a trucker's revolt. Four truckers are going to revolt, four of them. And it says vacancy, so there's not even four of them in there. And it's probably actually three rooms. Because one of them has to be the room where you check in to get your keys. <clears throat> so there's three rooms and there's a vacancy. So there's two truckers in there. A two trucker revolt. Yeah, okay. I'm not trying to badmouth truckers. I'm just saying two people is very few people. Doesn't matter if you're a trucker or anything else. It's not a revolt. It's so popular that there are a whole two truckers that are freaking out. Yeah, I don't buy it. There, there's some... There's some nefarious things going on in this town that a place that holds as m much as three rooms this is the place that's so popular where are the trucks then where are they it's it, they have so much space available that they even have a trailer store here One hundred one, one hundred two, one hundred three, one hundred four. okay so those rooms are numbered so those are all rooms so where do you get the keys we are on a big, giant mountain. I wonder if these rooms actually lead to a giant underground structure where there's just hundreds of thousands of rooms. And you park your truck somewhere down there. You have to... There's like an entrance for your trucks that are down at the bottom of this mountain or something. Ooh, I bet this, this trailer right here... Not the thing that's without wheels, just white uh, container. I bet you that opens up and there's stairs inside. That container is not just sitting on the ground. It's actually covering a hole in the ground, the stairwell. Or maybe it's this little blue shack that's the, got this secret hole in the ground. Sort of like, uh, like in Mafia. And promoted to level 22. Thank you, you're quite the mountaineer. But what's available for purchase? What, what, hold on, what, what was all that? What was available for purchase? I missed it. Alright, 
so we did more parts we did lumber mill supplies and we did on top of the world so let's end this stream here and in the next video those are still locked that's still the only one to do for blackbird which takes us to white valley so we're gonna skip that to so gr enterprise you are what we got next we got mountain maze and we got village delivery easy breezy beautiful cover girl shimon we're picking up wooden planks and fuel but if I gotta go to the wooden planks I'm actually gonna get the fuel from here two and one so we'll bring the trailer with us we'll do that in the next video I am Dan first person looter playing snow runner video number uh, 62 and this is the first snow runner video of the new year 2021 and I think we did pretty well for our first video of the new year Thanks so much. Take care. Have a good new year. Take care of yourselves and each other, as it's famously said. All right, whatever. I'm out of here. Bye-bye.